it is a distinguished honor to be able to attend at Carnegie Hall, first of all, but to be able to perform, that's pretty much once in a lifetime for a guy like me. I mean, like, to be, for our choir to be invited to Carnegie Hall, that's a pretty amazing thing. I've never been able to go to New York financially and because I may never get to go to New York. Ever since opening the program uh, back in 2000, I've worked with a lot of groups. It just so happens this last year's group were a particularly special batch of kids. From year to year, we've had really hardworking, really talented students. But every year we'd go to competitions, we'd get just this much closer to, to a gold level rating. And it turns out that what we needed for our program was a batch of students who were completely new to the program. Students who were willing to work so hard and so much extra, they took themselves beyond what was uh, originally thought capable. One of the benefits of us achieving this gold rating this last year was an invitation to perform with a mass choir with a professional conductor, uh, Dr. Andre Thomas, at Carnegie Hall. This is an opportunity that only comes along once in a lifetime. And these batch of students have really worked so hard, they have earned this great opportunity. One of the great things about my career choice is this opportunity to work with uh, these students who are just on the verge of going out into adulthood. I know myself, uh, having been involved in choir around their age, the opportunities that I was able to receive by doing things similar to this um, have formed the course of my life. I think my students can also have their lives changed and altered in this positive way if they had this kind of opportunity to go with them. Us being in the area that we're at in, the, in California, our financial prospects are not as bright as uh, we would hope. And I am worried that the students might not get this opportunity to go ahead and have this life-changing moment the way that I have had in my past. It's far, and um, far from Los Angeles, it's far from uh, San Bernardino, it's far from Las Vegas, which are the three uh, largest cities in our area. And, and because of this distance, there's very, there are very few opportunities for um, sponsorship. Our community is, is limited in, in that aspect. Um, sold seat cushions, we've sold popcorn, uh, we've sold candy and uh, other uh, catalog items. We can't fundraise enough, we can't bake enough cookies, we can't uh, sell enough uh, brownies to, to take these, these students all the way to New York. I, I don't know. We have doubts, though. I have doubts, at least within myself, because I know I can't really pay for all that. But Carnegie Hall, the invitation itself, it's just an honor. That's how I feel about Carnegie Hall. I'm honored for that opportunity. <laughs>